Well, hey there. Happy fun day 196. Sharon Horn Elstrom here with our 365 day fun challenge. Doing one fun thing every day in 2020 and beyond. From the little journal book, do one fun thing every day. Today is the beginning of a two part long singings day. So I'm going to grab my magnifying glass and let's see what it has to say. Something about toads. What would a toad say? It says, ask a toad what is beauty. He will answer that it is the female with two great round eyes coming out of her little head, her large flat mouth, her yellow belly, and brown back. This was written by Voltaire, and our challenge today says, ask a hippopotamus what beauty is, and it will answer blank. So if you were a hippopotamus, share in the comments below what beauty would be to you. Probably the size and weight and color would be different than you or I might consider something to be beautiful. And then also, just for bonus points, think about what is beautiful to you today and look around you and see how many beautiful things that you actually experience that you so often just overlook because we're so busy running through our lives and running about our day and doing the things that we think we have to do and not paying attention to all the beauty and all of the amazing things that exist around us all the time. Yesterday, my sister gave my granddaughter, we went to lunch with my sister and did some floor shopping and things. And she gave my daughter a beautiful blush pink hibiscus. And that started a whole chain of events in terms of us watching YouTube videos on how to take care of a hearty hibiscus, how to get a hibiscus, what colors they come in, how to, how to feed and care and grow and prune and and root them and do all kinds of things about hibiscus just because she saw something beautiful and investigated it. And now she of course thinks this blush pink hibiscus is the most beautiful thing in the whole wide world, the most beautiful flower in the whole wide world. So if you notice something that's around you, you can take it further and you can enjoy and have a lot more fun with it than if you don't notice the beauty that's around you. So what would a hippopotamus think is beautiful? What do you think is beautiful? Share that in the comments below. I will, of course, be with you tomorrow with another fun challenge from our little journal book, Do One Fun Thing Every Day. Have an amazing fun day. Bye.